We're here at Ginger Pho. They're at Weston Road and they're making something right now. It's really loud. We're here at Ginger Pho. It's at Weston Road and Cardell Avenue. What makes this pho restaurant more special and unique than any other ones in Toronto is the fact that they have the largest bowl of pho in Toronto. This thing is 16 inches across and it costs $45. When you order it, they give you a bunch of bowls that you can distribute the pho amongst a family or a group of people. I'm gonna be trying to eat as much as I can on my own, but I have two bowls for me and the cameraman. So if we can both finish this, that'll be pretty impressive because it's Thanksgiving today and later on I'm gonna have a lot of turkey. So I don't know how I'm gonna fit this all into me. Should be interesting. So the normal amount of bean sprouts and herbs you get for a bowl of pho is maybe I'd say a third of this size. I mean, look at this, this is massive. You just know what you're getting yourself into and you see the amount of bean sprouts on this plate right here. And even the chopsticks here are huge. Look at these. Here's normal chopsticks. So here's normal chopsticks. And these are the ones that we have to use for this pho. This is like a cup of tea's worth of just broth that you can be able to get with this spoon. Wow. Oh my goodness. Was it hard to carry it out? So here it is, the largest bowl of pho. This thing is massive in every way. The amount of broth that's in here, you have meatballs, tendon, beef, brisket, all the nice vermicelli noodles. Okay, so just to give you a little comparison, here's a normal bowl. Now compare that to this. Here's my massive spoon. Get all that broth. I'm gonna make myself a bowl. Let's get some noodles in there. Get some meat, of course. Get some meatballs. Let's try this ball. Mm. I feel like the brisket just brings the whole bowl together. We're gonna finally add these bean sprouts to here. Wow, just makes it even look more huge. After putting in the plate of bean sprouts, I ate, ate, and ate some more. This bowl is truly massive. After about five bowls of pho each, we are still left with this, with what appears to be half of the giant bowl of pho left. That is how much you get in this bowl. I am literally, I'm so sad. I feel heavier just sitting here right now. I feel like I'm gonna break the chair. Thank you for watching. Drop a like and leave a comment and let us know of your favorite pho spot in Toronto. Until next time.